well hello again welcome back to my channel subscription boxes and more with michelle and if this is your first visit well come on in and sit down and spend a little bit of time with me i would really appreciate it i hope you'll come back what is it i have to share with you today well guys i've been doing wreck this journal and i have all three of the create this book so i'm starting with the create this book one and I even have some artwork started so the papers are in here so but I want to do the cover so uh, I already tried to do the cover I had it, a lot of it done with markers that promptly wiped right off the book you can't even hardly tell that they were ever there and then I did it in pencil so that I can Oh, well, you know, if you, if one thing doesn't work out yet, just try something else. All right, so let me direct you down and we will get some Posca pins because I hear they work better out and uh, decorate this cover. Did I do anything on the back of it? Not yet. Oh, well, we'll start with the front and then we will discover what we're going to do with the rest. Something I need to remember, because I've already done a page, or, a, you know, two pages. Something I have to remember is this paper is very thin. And there is a lot of bleed. So this, which I had already done the artwork and just needed to do the black lines and the collar it in, um, is now not going to be able to be used, and I had to make a replacement of it to glue in and I'll have to do it again because I did the page I'll get, show it to you now but I'll show it to you again later you know where it says choose one color so I thought oh Zentangles and it went all through the pages so yeah so this one had to have a page made for it too. So anyways, I got to remember, just like the Rectus Journal, which doesn't have quite as bad a bleed, but it does have bleed uh, through it, it, depending on what you're using. Um, I have to remember to do the art on a separate piece of paper. And so you'll probably see me get upset with myself more than once because I will forget. Let's look down at the book so we can see the progress there isn't any but there will be hopefully Ugh. and you're zoomed in as far as i can get you all right well here's my book and you're gonna be looking at it upside down that way so if i turn it this way maybe you can see what i'm doing let me pick some colors that i like i don't want to do everybody does a rainbow i don't want to do a rainbow i want to do something else maybe i'm going to do just these four colors what do you think i think that might work all right which one do i start with they may not all be activated that one went across the room it wants it to run away. I'm trying to get the... There. Sometimes you have to bang them and stuff to get the ball moving. Get the ball moving. Okay, this one has been activated. I think I'm going to go over this. So, I don't know how many coats it's going to take, but we're going to go with it, okay? And I will speed you up so you don't have to watch me painfully slowly do this.
okay, well, I um, had to do a couple coats of the color and I went ahead and finished decorating it um, because there's been somebody on a or a couple of people maybe on motorcycles buzzing back and forth by my house and they're so loud I just gave up on trying to record it but I do want to show you my cover now that it's finished And I carried that around to hearts and stuff on the side there, on the spine, and then on the back. Now, the paper where it's got like the note taped up there, uh, I accidentally dropped my orange pen on there and it left a streak and it would not come off. I tried to rub it off and it was a streaky orange, so I just did the whole thing in that streaky orange. I put down, I put orange on my finger and rubbed it in and then took a damp tissue and tried to wipe it off and that's how it came out. I gotta be careful because there's some wet spots still. So I put um, paint on the paintbrush and dripping down and I didn't do the individual, like I drew a, a black line around the paint but I left the paints they're like in a puddle mixing um but they're separated on the paintbrush so, don't ask i don't know but on the uh and i made the washi tape stripey of the colors and again no it's not rainbow order um here hang on move my coffee so i don't tip it over i don't know if you can see that i made the scribble from the pencil I made it a regular like number two pencil so I made it like silver so it'd be like graphite but because you know it's my uh Mariah Elizabeth I had colored sprinkles coming out of it do you see that I hope I hope you like it I liked it better without the black around each of the sprinkles but um you couldn't see it real well you could see it up close but when you got back away from it you could only see a couple of the colors so I went ahead and went around them and I regret it but I don't because at least now you can see them so there you go thumbnail all right um I should have taken a thumbnail of it blank but I can get a picture off the internet of it plain. Um, I hope you like it. I like it. I Now I need to take um, the packing tape and tape over it, but I have got to be much more careful than I was. with. I was trying with the wreck this book. I was trying really, really hard, but it came out very wrinkly and everything, especially on the pages inside, because once it, the tape touched down, you couldn't pull it off because it, I tried and it was ripping the paper so I'm going to have to hold my breath cross my eyes stick my tongue out cross my fingers and my toes whatever and try to get it on straight and bubble free try to so anyways please tell me what you think of my cover and um, I guess I will go ahead and show you since it's finished. I will show you the picture again up close. The choose one color picture. Hopefully you can see that pretty well. I'll probably try to um, zoom in on it. That's why I'm giving it extra time. So... I've got other pictures drawn, but I have to um, do the line art and things. I don't like to sketch on the camera. Maybe I'll get to where I will feel better about doing that, but it makes me really, really nervous. Like having somebody watch you take a quiz or a test while like the teacher standing over your shoulder and looking and you don't, you didn't study, you know, and you know they're going to see it and they're going to know the answers are wrong but it's not it's different than 
them them greeting it at their you know while you're not there is different than them standing over you watching you fail and that's how i feel um about sketching and it takes me a long time and um i think i might get there but baby steps baby steps so i hope that you like what i've done and uh i hope you'll watch me continue to work in these books i've got all three uh create this book i've got the reckless journal and other uh carrie smith books a stack of them um i have the the one by bellamina um write this journal write this book write your journal i don't know i can't think of the name of it but i have it um I have a bunch. I did a video showing you the ones that I had. Um, but hopefully you will watch. And I'm not going to be doing... I mean, obviously I'm going to have to get through a couple before I go on to other ones. Or maybe I'll have two or three in the works. Like these two. Wreck this, you know, wreck this journal and create this book. And maybe one other one possibly to sort of cycle through but i can't get them all out or I'll, I'll start i'll have a little bit done in a lot of books and none of them finished the other one i have is the 365 days of art which i intend to just do some pages maybe that's the third thing that i'll do that way um it'll be something different and that one is big enough that it could get me through hopefully a few books um you know what I mean? You know, alternating and things. So, uh, I'm very in inspired right now to work on on these books. I don't know why. Um, I worked on a lot of art that you didn't see, like when I was sitting in with mom and things like that, because I I had limited space and limited time to work on you know i couldn't like drag out a bunch of stuff so it was easier to doodle and so do doodle i did i did a lot of zentangles and things like that um it's soothing it's comforting it's you know it it makes me happy happier um happyish and so i'm i hope you'll stick with me and um i'll still do reviews of things products as they come in from companies, Timu stuff as I continue to uh, buy things. I hear that may go away and I hope not because I really do like Timu and I, I realize all the things that could be wrong um, but I buy what I can afford and I know that I'm contribu contributing to the problem but I, me not buying won't stop the problem. If the whole world stopped buying, then it would maybe stop the problem. But not the whole world's not going to ever stop buying. So, um, you know, I wish that things were different in the world. I wish that things were much different all over the world. Um, but anyways, um, I'm going to continue working on art. And I've got art supplies to test out. Some from Timu. Some that came from a company that sent me a whole box of things to review. I can't find the email. I don't know who sent it. So I'm just going to have to say, whatever company <laughs> sent this to me, please let me know so I can put it in the description, you know, after I post the video and have to edit the description because I truly cannot find anything about it. Um, I found the art supplies, some of them on Amazon, but not all of them. So, I don't know. I don't know. I'll do my best. So, I hope you'll stick with me as I um, do a lot of different things or a lot of the same thing. I don't know. Um, my house is filling up with all the things I unbox and review. So, um I gotta slow down on that just a little bit um, before I become a horror house. <laughs> it would not be hard with Timu, you know, to be buried under stuff. 
So anyways, I'm just ran I'm babbling. You know, I like to babble. So anyways, let me know what you think. And let me know if the art is something that you uh, enjoy or not. Um, if you guys hate it, I'll just do it on my own time and, and not subject you to it. Uh, if more people li like it than, than hate it, then I might still do it. So anyhow, with all that, um, let me know or just stop by and say hi. Um, and please give me that big old thumbs up because, you know, that truly, really helps my channel. And please subscribe to my channel. It's my birthday month. It's a free birthday gift if you hit that subscribe. And please share my video with others so maybe they might subscribe as well. Never know. Maybe they like art. Thank you so much for watching and for listening to me babble. And you know I like to babble. And I'll see you again in a minute in another video. Bye guys!